Hello everyone. Today, we're tackling a common issue in VMware, the dreaded host SM bus controller not enabled error. This usually pops up in Ubuntu 17.04 when running as a guest operating system in VMware Workstation 12.5.x. It can cause performance issues and generally be annoying. Don't worry. I'll walk you through a simple fix. First, let's understand the problem. The SM bus controller allows communication between the motherboard and other devices. VMware needs to emulate this for your virtual machine. Sometimes, the emulation isn't enabled by default, leading to the error message. To resolve this, we need to modify the virtual machine's configuration file, the .vmx file. Make sure your virtual machine is completely shut down before proceeding. Do not just suspend it. Now, navigate to the directory where your virtual machine files are stored. The .vmx file should be in the same folder as your virtual hard disk. Open the .vmx file with a text editor like Notepad or TextEdit. Scroll to the bottom of the file or use the search function to find an empty line. On that line, add the following line of code, smbios.reflecthost equals true. This line tells VMware to reflect the host machine's smbios information to the guest OS. Save the .vmx file. Ensure that the file extension remains .vmx and doesn't accidentally become .txt. Next, power on your virtual machine. In most cases, that host SM bus controller not enabled error should now be gone. If the error persists, there might be other underlying issues. For instance, check if you have the latest VMware tools installed. Outdated or corrupted VMware tools can sometimes cause conflicts. To install or update VMware tools, go to the VM menu in VMware Workstation and select Install VMware Tools or Update VMware Tools. Follow the on-screen instructions. Another potential solution involves manually adding the SM bus device to the virtual machine's configuration. This is a more advanced approach. We add the line devices.pcibridge4.present equals true to the .vmx file. After adding this line, also add devices.pcibridge4.pci-slot number equals 36. Remember to save the .vmx file and restart the VM. If none of these solutions work, consider upgrading to a newer version of VMware Workstation. Older versions might have compatibility issues with newer operating systems like Ubuntu 17.04. That concludes our troubleshooting guide for the SM bus controller issue. I hope this has helped you resolve the error and improve the performance of your Ubuntu virtual machine. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing for more tutorials. Your support helps us create more content. You can also support us via Patreon or buy me a coffee.